Welcome back to the Penix channel. The name is John, and the product is Cinefuego Toast Crunch. That's what I'm going to be reviewing today. What is Cinefuego Toast Crunch? Well, it is a cereal that is supposed to have a sweet cinnamon heat. If you look at the ingredients, grains, sugar, rice flour, canola, sunflower, fructose, maltodextrin, dextrose, salt, Cinnamon, natural flavors, trisodium phosphate, soy lecithin, caramel color, DHT. So cinnamon is the only spice in here. Um, if you've ever had like the red hot candies, those are supposed to be uh, cinnamon as well. And those can get pretty spicy. So I'm interested to see how spicy this Cinefuego Toast Crunch is. And uh, this is the only type of uh, serving size you can get it in. This uh, little bag, which has 5.9 ounces in it. It is a limited edition. It doesn't come in a regular cereal box or anything like that. Um, it makes me think like maybe they're selling it more as like a snack you eat out of the bag than a cereal. But it is resealable. Um, I am going to taste it by itself and in a bowl with some milk. Let's go ahead and open it up, try it out, see how spicy it is, see if it's actually good. So you can see this is the first time I'm opening it. Got a little sprinkle of cinnamon fall out of there. Ooh, it does smell like a, a red hot cinnamon candy. Here's what it looks like. Kind of like a regular cinnamon toast crunch. Like visually not too much different maybe like more encrusted on there let's give it a taste mm. yeah it definitely has that like cinnamon red hot candy flavor to it so if you're a fan of red hots basically the same flavor except instead of a hard or chewy candy it's in a crunchy cereal let's go ahead and try a little bit with the milk i'm not going to make like a whole bowl here just enough to like get a flavor on the milk And get the uh, get a good guess estimate review. Is it better as a snack or is it better as a cereal? Got a little milk here. Just pour right in there. And then also, one good thing about cereal and milk is that after you're done eating the cereal, the milk can then have a, its own little flavor to it as well. So the, the, the pieces I've had already is leaving a, a lingering tingly spice on my tongue and the inside of my mouth. I think that's a good enough time to wait in the milk. Let's give it a taste. It's also like milk is supposed to quell spiciness. It'll be interesting how it tastes. It's a real deep, rich cinnamonness. What makes a cinnamon more spicy than another? You can get like a, a shaker of cinnamon, or even like real cinnamon bark. And I don't think it, I've ever tried any of that. It's really super spicy, but this has a definite heat to it. Red Hots, which are cinnamon flavors, have a def definite heat to it. 
So is it a is it a way that they're being processed? Is it a, a specific breed of cinnamon plant? The coolness of the temperature of the milk, I feel like it delays like the pain receptacles of, of the heat, but once your, your mouth overcomes that coolness, once you uh, swallow the milk and all you have left is what's managed to rub off inside your mouth, the heat is still there and it is a good amount. It's not... Peppery heat and cinnamony heat are a little bit different um, flavor-wise, definitely. They're still like, it gives you the same pain reaction about heat. I feel like my, my cheeks are a little warmer than they were before I started eating. Um, I haven't gotten like a full-on... Uh, runny nose situation um but i feel like it's definitely loosening up in there let me see what the heat heated cinnamon milk tastes like that uh the milk part tastes really sweet like cinnamon but I didn't really get a lot of heat from it. Interesting. It's like only the sweet cinnamon flavor mixed in with the milk. And none of the heat. Anyway, that's pretty good. Cinna Fuego Toast Crunch. If you are a fan of the flavor of red hot candy, um, then this tastes exactly like the same profile. The texture, of course, is going to be different. Um, eating it as a bowl of cereal or eating it as a snack, I fully endorse both situations. But uh, Cinefuego Toast Crunch, getting a thumbs up from the Fat Hipster channel. Um, I don't know if children necessarily will like it. Especially because it's uh, got like particles and dust that you get in your fingers. Children wipe their eyes with that. It's probably not the best idea. So I'd probably keep it away from uh, kids. But anyone else? Or more responsible age children? Sure. It's not like the type of spice that the, it's going to send someone crying. But uh, if you wipe in your eyes, you might definitely get some crying going on. So if we get Toast Crunch from General Mills, that's the review. Hope you enjoyed it. Give the video a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. See you on the next one. So long. Farewell. Goodbye.